Na kwingine ni kwamba viongozi wa kanisa la sita mwikendi hii walienda sherehe ya kuaga wajumbe wa bodi ya mashemasi na baraza la wazee ambao muda wao wa kuhudumu umefikia kikomo. Akizungumza katika hafla hiyo askofu mkuu wa kanisa la sita Mkalisto Dede alipongeza viongozi hawa ambao wamemaliza muda wao wa kuhudumu na kuwakaribisha wale ambao wanachukua nafasi zao. Mwanabari wetu Grace Hati na taarifa hiyo. Hallelujah ni na sababu ya kuku abudu Kanisa la 6 msiku ya Jumamosi liliandaa sherehe ya kuaga wajumbe wa bodi ya mashemasi na baraza la wazee waliomaliza muda wao wa kuhudumu Wajumbe wa bodi ya mashemasi wanaondoka ni pamoja na shemasi George Asoyo, Christine Ojera, Catherine Wahome na Esther Chengo wale wa baraza la wazee wakiwa ni Don Odera na aliyekuwa katibu wa baraza hilo Teresia Fiu Wanaojiunga na baraza la wazeni Emily Chengo na Agnes Omolo huku wajumbe wa bodi ya mashemasi wanaoshika usukani wakiwa James Masinde, Margaret Wainaina, Joseph Muliaro wa Fula na George Morara Ondonga. Wakizungumza katika hafla ya kuaga, viongozi hao na ustaafu walisimulia hatua alizopiga pamoja na changamoto zilizowakabili katika muhula wao. Just the workings of the church, the cohesion, the pulling together, the focus on the vision. That for me is actually an embodiment of uh, how Jesus himself uh, taught. As a ministry, we have been able to start, I would say, 13 assemblies. And uh, it's simply because the deacon board and the council of elders work in a, a very smooth way. So we are able to take our ministry forward. And one thing that I'm grateful serving in the board is that Sitam as a ministry gives everybody who qualifies a chance to serve. My experiences, they've been wonderful, mixed of course, uh, they've been ups and downs, but mostly, mostly glorious. Aida waliwahimiza wanachama wapya wanaoshika usukani kufanya kazi kwa pamoja na kumtumaini Mungu. For the incoming team, I want to tell them, just like God was with us for the five years, God will still be with them. He will be a human sure that they will be in perfect health he will make sure that he will mind their business even as they mind his business and the business of his people we must intentionally think about bringing the youth into conversations and collaboration with the youth kenya right now we have over 80% of kenya having um, youth under the age of 35 so we have to ask ourselves how are we intentionally including the youth in the conversation huku akielezea jinsi hop media inafanya kazi kwa karibu na baraza la wazena uongozi wa mashemasi mkuu wa hop media dismas makanda aliwashukuru wanachama hao kwa maamuzi yao madhubuti ambayo yamechangia ukuaji wa hope media our board is constituted from members from a deacon board and therefore the knowledge and the wisdom that comes from the deacon board trickles down to the media board which runs uh, the entire media house and therefore we as management We are glad that we're going to serve under people who are experienced but also people who love God and they are passionate. Kwa upande wake, askofu mkuu wa kanisa la sita Mkalisto Odede aliipongeza timu iliyomaliza muda wake kwa kujitolea kwao kumtumikia Mungu. And as we look back on the tenure of those who have uh, completed their service uh, a tremendous kind of input uh, the kind of sacrifice uh, that we have seen in them many many hours of meetings uh, to give sitam direction uh, uh, sometimes even when we feel like uh, we uh, are getting a little tired uh, but just to see their hearts and their commitment uh, as continue to give me uh, even encouragement niki ripoti adira mi grace ahati